How you doing? This is Willard Maxwell, the broker and owner of Maxwell Realty, and I'm at one of my properties that I've purchased in order to rent. Um, there's so many different ways to make money in real estate, and I'm always here to help you. I always try to get my clients to purchase first, but when they don't jump on a deal that I tell them to jump on, then I jump on it. So somebody's out there regretting that they didn't jump on this deal, but hey, my job is to put you first because I'm the broker that's gonna walk you through the process. So this house right here, I got it. I have a certain type of voucher. I'm receiving $1,900 a month for this four bedroom in order to rent it out. My positive income is about $800 a month of renting it out. Of course, I put in ramps and some things because the person has some disabilities. But at the end of the day, I'm still making a positive income of $800 a month. That's a great spread for those who are experienced renters. A lot of times you're trying to get at least $200, $300 that you're making a positive income, but I'm making $800. That's nothing but God and that's nothing but business and spiritual um, working together. Jesus said, when you do it to the least of these, you've done it unto me. And a lot of times people don't want to help the disenfranchised. People don't want to help the people without a voice. But sometimes God, when God gives you the overflow, he said, I'll give you a blessing that you won't have room to receive. And what he's really saying is when I give you this blessing, I don't need you to go out and buy another Benz, another Range Rover all the time. I need you to make sure that you're able to bless the people that are in need and make sure that you take care of my people. That's, that's absolutely right. Yeah, I yeah. love that. We are blessed to be a blessing. That's yes. one of Pastor Maxwell's yes. uh, very common sayings. And we, we love being blessings to other people because that's why God blessed us. And then we could draw other people to Christ in that way sometimes too. Right. Yeah. We got her to help me with my compassion a little more sometimes. So sometimes my business side and my compassion side, they clash. But I believe God gives us both to make sure that we have a balance. And you don't be taken advantage of in the situation. So we help who we can help. We can't help everybody. That's why we need more investors to step up. That's why we need more people to step up and say, you know what, I'm going to step up and purchase a home so we can make sure that we take care of those who are, who are, uh, uh, it's not as fortunate as us. And the thing about it is even though you're taking care of them, you're still going to make money. So you're blessing people who other people don't want to deal with, but because of the voucher system that we're connected to, you're still getting paid to help you. So come on out and help and help yourself at the same time and help someone in need so you can be doing business and ministry at the same time. Absolutely.